So this is probably my favorite topic as someone that was an ASE certified technician and spent years in automotive school and high school. EVs are more complex to get serviced and maintained. What people don't realize, a typical internal combustion engine has about 2,000 moving parts, while your average EV has 20 to 25 moving parts. In an internal combustion engine, you'll have moving parts like more and more modern cars are getting turbochargers, you have uh, pumps, injectors, filters, camshafts, crankshafts, and sensors, and all the things that go along with that. You have thermostats which move, all of these different components. But EV batteries are so expensive to replace. Yes, they are expensive to replace. They're not pocket change. But consider this, since 2008 to 2023, the price of an EV battery has gone down 90%. It's funny to me when people highlight how expensive it is to replace an EV battery pack without really knowing the facts. So in order for modern internal combustion engines like gasoline, diesel to hit emissions requirements and EPA fuel mileage requirements for manufacturers, timing and precision has become increasingly more challenging in terms of transmissions, engines, and all these different variables. So looking at just a couple factors, 37% of modern cars are sold turbocharged or with some level of forced induction. That's massively up since the 80s or the 90s. The average cost to replace a turbocharger across, this is just the average pricing, is two to $6,000. Um, the average cost to replace a transmission, two to $7,000. The average cost to replace an engine, five to $10,000. The other big factor that a lot of people don't realize is that the United States government has a mandate across all electric vehicles being sold that they need to have coverage, warranty coverage, for at least eight years, 100,000 miles on the battery packs. So let's step back for a second. What does it look like to maintain an electric vehicle versus an internal combustion engine vehicle all the way from zero to 100,000 miles. To maintain an internal combustion engine vehicle requires maintaining things like routine oil changes, spark plugs, serpentine belts, timing belts, thermostats, fuel filters, air filters, all of these different components. So on average, to get to 100,000 miles, it'll cost an internal combustion engine owner, on average, $9,200 in maintaining. But on average, it's $9,200. In contrast, a typical EV will be around $4,600. $4, and I'm assuming a lot of that is going directly towards tires and probably windshield wiper fluid. 